Tesla recently announced a 5 to 1 stock split, going into effect on August 31st. This announcement initially caused Tesla stock to skyrocket after hours, and it's continued on an upward trend. But what does this actually change? Technically, it doesn't really change anything other than the price of each share. I'm going to say, just for this video, that Tesla is $1,500. That'll simplify a lot of things, especially as I go through the numbers. So, a share of Tesla will be worth $300 rather than $1,500. But the market cap, EPS, and almost everything else about the stock will be exactly the same. You can think of it as four $5 bills versus a single $20 bill. It's the exact same amount of money, but it can be easier to work with smaller bills. The value of your investments won't change. Ally Invest sent me an email claiming that split stocks have historically outperformed the S&P 500 meaning greater returns for the company. And I believe them. Generally, stock splits mean the value of the company has grown by an order of magnitude from their IPO. And a reverse split is generally bearish. Now, is this strange or unheard of? Not really. Apple also announced another stock split. And companies do it all the time, especially as prices skyrocket from their IPO. Going back to the Ally email, if you bought a single share of Apple in 1987, you would own 224 shares today. That's how many splits they've had. So what if you have Tesla stock? Well, one share of Tesla will transform into five shares, but each of your shares will be worth one-fifth of the current share price. Again, the same total amount of money. Although this does bring up the question of options. Options contracts almost universally control 100 shares of a security. This is true for Tesla options. So let's say you had a single options contract that had a strike price of $1,500. That controls 100 shares at $1,500, obviously. Now, it'll be five contracts at $300 strike prices. In total, you'll control 500 shares across five contracts. Now, this is a relatively clean split, so you really don't need to worry too much. More complicated splits like three to two can result in a strange non-100 share options contract that might have lower liquidity. The Options Cleaning Corporation Corporation, OCC, establishes a whole set of rules for how stock splits affect options. In fact, they've released a report for Tesla. This is a detailed page with everything you need to know. A report will be generated every time a stock splits, at least every time an optionable stock splits. It's really interesting to go through the whole report and look at each detail, but it'll spell everything out and give you exact numbers for every single strike price available. They're very detailed, and if you're super concerned, I would consider taking a look at this. Again, you just need to go to the OCC website, and if you're still struggling to understand this, Fidelity has this really good learning center that talks about option contract adjustments. And it goes into detail about a lot of things and gives some examples. In this case, I wouldn't worry too much unless your brokerage charges a lot of fees for selling a single contract. A lot goes into this, and I plan on releasing a stock split option video in the future. But this one is pretty clean and not too complicated. I would say you don't have to worry too much. Everything will be adjusted for you. So why do a stock split? Well, there are a couple reasons. First one is you open yourself up to smaller investors, individual investors. Employee stock options have been popular for a long time. I know a lot of old timers who worked at Bendix when they took over Martin Marietta and then Allied Signal tried to merge with them. There was a lot going on and the stock price essentially quadrupled. Well, Bendix was big on employee stock options. So they offered a lot of stock to employees. Now there were tons of employees with tons of stocks and the stock price essentially quadrupled in a day or so or something along those lines. The former employees I talked to said that employees were lined up around the massive aerospace manufacturing facility twice, all in line to sell their stock. The company actually held a Bendix Unity Day where they gave people pins and they had carnival-like attractions. It was basically Hey, hey, have a hot dog. Please don't sell your stock, please. <laughs> Not to harp too much for an old story, but employee stock options have been hugely popular for a long, long time. Especially if a company is doing very well, it wants the employees working for it to be stockholders. They 
want their employees to care about the company and help advance it forward. And this is a practice that has been going on for a long time, even before the phone trading app era of today. Tons of companies also offer matching on 401ks and purchasing of company stock as part of your 401k is a practice that tons of successful companies use. Now, if your stock is $1,500, it's very hard to integrate it into a 401k or employee stock option plan. The average household income in the United States is just under $62,000 yearly, not individual. So let's say you're making $50,000 a year after taxes, which is pretty solid considering average household incomes. That's just under $4,200 every month. Are you going to put over a third of your paycheck every month into Tesla stock? You really shouldn't be paying over 25% of your monthly income on housing. So to put it all in stock is pretty insane, especially for a single company. Now, I'm not saying that I think Tesla will go down, but you got to understand that is very risky, especially for a retirement plan. I think Tesla is doing fantastic, but again, that is quite risky relative to other options. So when you have a lower stock price, it makes things significantly more accessible and reasonable for your employees to invest in your company. And Tesla is in fact a company that offers employee stock options. Another reason to split the stock is not just helping out your employees as investors, but all the small investors that are out there right now. The modern market has changed in a huge way due to commission-free trading apps like Robinhood or Webull. Almost anyone can get an app on their phone and invest with little to no money. In general, stocks are shifted by large institutional investors, but there's no denying that the average consumer has become a force of nature, as seen by the insanely risky and questionable trades that absolutely blew up. like buying Hertz stock. There are a lot of investors out there, individual investors, who can't even afford a single share of Tesla stock. So this makes the stock way more accessible and thus introduces tons of smaller investors. Also consider that even when it comes to large individual investors or very small institutional investors, that options contracts control 100 shares of a stock. An individual or company might not want to buy less than 100 shares of a stock because they won't be able to sell covered calls on that stock. Covered calls are very powerful because they let you extract more money from holding a stock and can even allow you to turn a profit on a stock end up bag holding. 100 shares of Tesla would be $150,000. That's a lot of money for a single person. Imagine you or a small company has $1 million to invest. 15% of your portfolio into a single stock is pretty major when you're dealing with that much money. As a smaller investor, diversification is arguably less important, but still, $30,000 for 100 shares at 300 a pop is much more reasonable and makes Tesla stock significantly more appealing especially since Tesla is not a dividend stock, so holding it can potentially be riskier than other options. I would say overall, this is really nice. A lot of people have been calling for a Tesla stock split for a while, and I think it's really going to help with these smaller investors. They've really become huge and popular. If you're interested in grabbing a pretty good phone app for investing, Webull is pretty good. I've been using it as a secondary brokerage, and I have an affiliate link in the description if you're interested. If you deposit 100 bucks, you'll get two free stocks. Overall, it seems like Tesla is on the right path, and I anticipate things are going to go very well for them. Their price has been climbing and climbing because of this news, and I don't blame people. This is always an exciting moment.